Hey everyone! Have you ever wondered about the Golden Age of Islam and its incredible contributions to science and astronomy? Let's dive right into one of history's most intellectually fertile periods. The Golden Age of Islam, spanning roughly from the 8th to the 14th century, was a time when science, culture and philosophy flourished under Islamic rule. This era was marked by vast advancements and a profound embrace of knowledge. Muslim scholars weren't just students of their own culture's knowledge. They also absorbed the works from the Greeks, Persians and Indians, translating and expanding upon them. This blend of knowledge helped ignite tremendous scientific quests. In the field of astronomy, scholars like Al-Batani and Al-Zarqali made groundbreaking improvements to the astronomical tables of their time. These enhancements not only refined the calendar, but also greatly influenced the navigational techniques used around the world. Medicine too saw revolutionary changes. Physicians like Al-Razi and Ibn Sina, also known in the West as Avicenna, wrote extensively on diseases and treatments, setting the foundation for modern medical practices. Ibn Sina's The Canon of Medicine was a standard medical text in many medieval universities across the globe. And let's not forget about mathematics. Scholars like Al-Khwarizmi developed algebra, a word derived from his book Al-Kitab al-Muqtasar fi Hisab al-Jabr wal Mukabala, simplifying the previously complex calculations of inheritance laws and other needs in Islamic law. So, what do you think? Did these scientific marvels during the golden age of Islam pique your interest? If you enjoyed this glimpse into history and want to explore more amazing stories from the past, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.